Well, at the end of the last episode, we talked about how my system crashed and the game took me and put me outside of the fog wall. Gave me all of my soul souls. Gave me all of my runes, which is nice. Gave me all of my flasks back, which is nice. But it did get, it did not give me all of my FP back, which I find incredibly odd. Uh, but we're gonna go ahead and uh, drink this flask of cerulean tears here to get my FP back up because I'm gonna want to call in uh, the wolves. I mean, I think the wolves are helping. I don't know. Probably gonna die in here anyway. But, um, I don't want to go all the way back to the site of Lost Grace. Because it's a long trek. He's going to come over here to me. He's going to straight, head straight for me. Set him in the armpit. Okay, so he's got some thing where... Ouch. He uh, sticks his hand in the ground. And then when he pulls it up, that hurts. <laughs> the sound my guy makes. <gasps> the wolves on the ground there. They're getting swiped. Oh, okay. See, so there's that thing he does. Where he pulls his hand up out of the ground. Just, and then I'm dead. But not dead. Uh, one of my wolves are gone. Crap, this is not a good start. Okay, that was very painful. Okay, this is not going well. I've only got one wolf left, and I don't, I don't even have to be half, down to halfway yet. And I'm still not real clear on what's going on here, because this looks like lightning to me, but it does a frostbite effect on me. So, yeah, not real clear on this. <laughs> Look at that one wolf running over there. Oh, okay. Well, that was a new move. Okay, so I'm probably going to die here. Um, not real sure what's the best strategy for this guy yet. Base. Yeah, all my wolves are gone. Huh. All my homies are gone. Okay, and I got frostbite. Okay, this is pretty annoying. Not, um, not feeling like I have a good grasp of this. Now, one thing I haven't been doing is using my skill. Whatever my skill is, ground slam. I really doubt that's going to make any difference. Um, I mean, should I try to find some armor that helps against frostbite? Let's see here. Frost, well, what's frostbite? Um, what resistance do I need against frostbite? I don't know. Um... Let's see, this is poisons and rot, blood loss and frost. So I need something that's robust, and this is actually pretty robust, I feel like. Right? Offers some good robustness resistance or whatever. Uh, this is better. This is better. Ooh, this is good. Ooh, I could go back to my Vagabond tonight armor. That way I'd still be protected pretty well. Yeah, this is more robust, so let's go with that. It's not as cool looking, but it will offer some protection, some extra protection, I think. Okay, uh, the wolves really don't seem to be doing much, so um, what if we switched to, let's see here, switch to, what else do I have? We've got these demi-human guys um, that they come back to life. Unless they're killed, like, twice. Right, let's try them. I don't know. Let's just try some stuff. Try some different strategies. Because what I'm doing now is not working. Okay, we're going to bring up our... Demi-humans. Wow, five of them? I did not realize I had that many of them. Are these the guys that come back to life? Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. Demi-humans? What are you doing, man? What are you doing, demi-humans? Come over here. Where are they? I only saw one. Okay, there they are. They, they've already started the fight. And yeah, maybe these aren't the guys that come back to life. But there are five of them. I'm 
going to go ahead and, uh, oh, okay, never mind. I want to drink a flask of tears here. And, um... Oh, okay, so it's that thing that I've got. Doesn't really seem to do much to him. Probably not the best skill to have against him. Oh, man. Okay, let's wail on this guy. Okay. Well, we, uh, broke his guard. Holy cow. We are wailing on this guy. Holy cow. Wow, if I could stay alive, we may have a shot at this guy. Oh, okay. Stay alive, demi-humans. <laughs> Did I get him? I got him. Okay. Well, demi-humans. Highly recommended. Frozen Lightning Spear is our reward for that. And we got a lot of uh, runes, which uh, I was so engaged in the battle that I forgot to pick up my runes, so it's a good thing that I won. Otherwise, those runes would have been lost forever. So we got 12,000 runes for fighting that guy, for beating him. That was pretty cool. I don't know, maybe I just got lucky that time, but uh, man, we just made quick work of him, didn't we? Frozen Lightning Spear. Let's take a look at it. It look, well, it looked like a sorcery, didn't it? But apparently it's not. It is an incantation. Incantation that channels the power of the Dragonkin soldiers. Creates a spear of ice lightning and stabs it into the ground from above. On impact, the spear will burst into trails of lightning advancing forwards. The dragonkin were born in the Eternal City, where they knew no true sky, nor true lightning. Instead, ice lightning was their weapon. Okay, so I guess that's what we were seeing there. It looked like lightning, but it was actually ice, and that is why we got frostbite. Let me run over here and grab my runes so I don't forget. Wherever they are. Boy, they are. Oh, there's a um, site right there. That's nice. Man, I died way over here, huh? That is so funny to me that I totally... Normally when I enter a boss arena that I've died in before, I make a beeline for my runes, but for whatever reason, that time I just totally forgot. Okay. Let's go ahead and rest here. And we'll do a level up. I mean, I don't think he even used his ice lightning in that battle. So I don't even think the Vagabond armor made any difference. We're gonna go ahead and level up. Oh my gosh, I don't even have enough runes to level up. Damn, okay. Need about, um, what, 500 more? A little more than 500 more? All right, uh, yep. I could handle that pretty easily here. Go in here and go down to these guys and we we'll use some of these. I have 70 of these things. Why am I holding on to them? I don't know. It's best not to ask questions like that. The, the reason I'm holding on to him is for what you just saw. So when I need a few more runes, I can use them to level up. I know I know I don't need to hold as many as I'm holding, but I am. Uh, I've been getting strength up. Let's just keep doing that. Because that's my build. I'm a strength build. Oh, I didn't even look at what the name of this site was. I like to know the names of the sites. This one is Dragonkin Soldier of Noxtella. So, looks like there's some doors over there that have opened up. Still can't hop on my horsey. Uh, there's waterfalls over here. You know you've got to go look behind them. It's um, an adventure game tradition. Make sure that there's no hidden passages back here. Doesn't appear to be. Uh, let's see what's behind this thing. Looks like a big drop-off, maybe. Yeah. Ooh. Huh. Well, there's another site down there. At the foot of that big waterfall. Oh, there's a building up there, too. Wow. Yeah, I wish the map was a little more... 
useful here, but it is not even a little bit useful. Alright, well this is probably going to be an elevator that takes us down then, I imagine. Oh no, it's a chest. Let's see what's in it. Great Ghost Glove Warts. Great Ghost Glove Warts. White flower that blooms in catacombs. A spirit nestles close to this grand specimen. Strengthens renowned ashes to plus ten. Since times of old, large glove warts were used to comfort heroic spirits. Given in tribute to those who died the most glorious of deaths in the hope their stories would become legend. Okay. Uh, I, don't, I do not know what a renowned ash is. Don't know what that is. Well, there we go. That's the end of that. Doesn't look like this is going to take me anywhere. Which, as I've said before, is not my favorite. Don't like it when the boss is at a dead end. I like it when defeating a boss opens up a new area to explore. But that does not seem to be the case this time. But yeah, I am very curious about that um, site down there. Is there any way to, to tell by looking at a site whether I've already discovered it or not? I mean, that one doesn't look familiar. I don't remember there being a site right at the foot of a waterfall, but... You know, I don't remember everything, so it's possible that I've been there already. Um... There's a part of me that wants to just jump off this to see what would happen. Uh... I mean, it'd probably kill me, right? And if it does, I'm, I'm kind of like, big deal. Let's see. Yeah, it just kills me almost instantly. Okay. You know, I mean, sometimes in Souls games, there's a um, drop that uh, looks impossible, and but you can do it. So, I don't know. I just thought I'd give it a shot. And uh, it was no big deal because I only had 78 runes, and frankly, I'm not even sure why I'm running over here to pick them back up. Just because I want to clear them off the screen, mostly. You know, I don't like it when I have that marker on my compass up there. So we'll go ahead and pick these up. Okay, well, uh, let's exit this giant arena here. Um, I'm pretty sure that there are more, still more places to explore down here. So let's get back to exploring. And we'll see what there is to see. So here's the uh, entrance over here. I mean, do I want to go back this way? I don't know, man. Oops. Get our lantern out. Nothing back here. And then I think... Isn't this... Where all those ants were? No. Hmm. Hmm. Uh. Okay, over here we've just got some more of these coffins. It's interesting. You know, some of the coffins are made of wood. Some of them are stone. Okay, here's some ants. Okay, this is where I thought that the, um, that was gonna hurt me over there, but it didn't. So the, these ants ignore me if I don't engage them? We've already been that way. And this is where we came in from. And I mean, I don't know if backtracking is really the best way to do this. I mean, I guess I could have fast traveled back over to that other 
sight, but I've decided to go this way. Let's see what's up here. Oh, look. Uh, I think I've already seen this site, haven't I? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've already seen this one. Okay, so yeah, well, yeah, I could have just fast traveled back to this, but I ran, I ran so far away. All right, so we've got this, yeah, old palace ruins, this bizarre place here where some, oh, duck on it, some meanie shoots things at me. Uh, I'm going to see if there's a way I could get up there behind him, maybe. Just see if there's another path to take. I've made this jump over here before, so I know it's doable. So there he is. He's gonna start shooting at me. Maybe if I run over here. Okay, he hopefully can't reach me here. Okay, it doesn't seem like he can. Okay. This is very exciting. A whole new place to explore. I see an item over there, but... We also saw an item over here before that I want to go see if we could get. It looks like we can. Uh, okay, it looks like maybe he could shoot me there. Okay, that was dumb. Boy, I really timed that poorly. Uh, Smithing Stone level 3, which I believe is what I need in order to upgrade my weapon. Right? I believe so. Uh, unfortunately, I... Well, I was going to say I don't have enough runes to pay for it, but I really do. Uh, what do you say we go ahead and um, we uh, head on back to Round Table Hold and we'll upgrade our weapon since we can. Right? Where is it? There it is. Let's go back here real quick. I mean, we come right back to that, um, that side of Lost Grace, so this is not too terribly terrible. Okay. Uh, over here is where our friend is. Well, I took you no matter today. Out your own. Well, he gives up on us awful soon, doesn't he? He thinks we're dead every time. Okay, so in order to to wow, I ha actually have eight smithing stone level threes. I didn't realize I picked up that many. Cool. Uh, I need two thousand two hundred and thirty-six runes for this. So. Go in here. Uh, problem is I have no idea how much these are worth. This one's worth 400. And then um, this one is worth 800. Okay. Whoops. And then I need about 200 more, I think, to pay for this. Let us go ahead and use actually two of these just to be sure. Back already. Mm -hmm. No matter. Lay out your arms. I'm going to lay out my arms here. Okay, we are going to improve our heavy Zweihander from plus 8 to plus 9. And now I need... Ooh! Uh, I need two Smithing Stone level 4s, and I have 13 of them. So if I had more runes, I could get this thing up to plus 10. Okay. All right. Let's just go ahead and do this. We have so many of these. Um, what do I want to use? Like 12 of these, I think. Should be enough. Back already, no matter. Yeah. Get this thing up to plus 10. Well, holy cow, we can get up to plus 11. <laughs> okay. here and we use 13 of these wow I was not expecting this uh, apparently we've collected a lot of smithing stone level fours on our travels which makes me think that I did things out of order but that's okay so we are now up to plus 11 
Holy cow, I could go even farther. You gotta be kidding me. Okay, we could get it up to plus 12. Wow. Well, this is all very exciting. I'm excited. I hope you're excited. Uh, let's see here. True, true, true. I'm gonna do 14 of these. I mean, these these golden runes practically grow on trees. Back already, my At least these level one ones do. Okay. Holy cow, I could go again! <laughs> Look at this, I have five smithing stone level fives and I only need two of them. Okay. This is great! Oh, I'm gonna be so powerful. Look out. Look out. I mean, I have so many of these, let's just go ahead and use them. Back already, no matter. Okay, there we go. Finally reached our limit, and we're not far off from getting up to plus 15. We just need one more smithing stone level 5, and we can get our heavy Zweihander to plus 15. Awesome. Okay, well, nice doing business with you there, dude. Um, can I upgrade any of my, uh, ashes? Um, no, I don't, I need glove, or grave glove wart level three to get these guys up anymore. I need level six for this one. And, um, six, level six, level six, level four, three, three, one, one, and one. Okay. All right. I mean, we did just kill a boss. Um, I mean, I don't think it was like a hugely important boss. I don't know if anybody's going to say anything about it. Oh, hello there. What can I do for you? Yeah, he has nothing to say about the boss, new boss, boss fight. What about him? Ah, you appear well, then. Okay, he has nothing and new to say. Order shines. Out here. She has nothing to say. Go, go, go forth. And then... This guy, will he talk to us? Nope, he won't. And this guy's probably gonna say the same thing. Journey to yeah. the capital. Journey to the capital. So he has nothing new to say. And we'll check in on Rogier real quick and then we will be on our way. Don't think we've met anybody else new except for. Don't, not sure where Thops went. Always good to see you, son. What do you need? Okay. Well, he has nothing to say either. All right, let's get out of here. We'll go ahead and just head right back to where we just were. Uh, which I think was downstream. I hope that's right. I'm pretty sure that's right, because Well Depth is where we started this whole thing. Okay, here we go. Let's uh, equip our little lantern. And we'll get out our torch as well. Really get a good look at this place. Okay, this guy hasn't seen me yet. Golden Rune level 2. Okay. Alright. Well. <laughs> I love this piece of music. Oh, there's a there's a dude here. Man, you've made yourself hard to get to, my friend. You don't mind if I pick up this item, do you? A map of Ansel River. I'll be doggone. This whole time I've been complaining about wishing that... Uh, the map was better, and by golly, I found a better map. Look at this. Huh. Okay. Wow. Okay. Interesting. Here's where we entered the well depths here. Here is Old Palace Ruins, which I guess this is where we are. This whole thing is the palace. Here is the downstream where we just were. Uh, this is where we fought and beat that dude. Um, but it looks like there's all kinds of structures here. 
so I guess from here, I, for whatever reason, decided to go left. But it looks like maybe there's more another path this way. And I'm not sure what's going on here. I don't know if I could go this way or not. And there's all kinds of stuff up here. I can't quite place uh, the arena here. Because um, there was this, this structure that had a chest in it. And then beyond that was a, uh, a waterfall that dropped way down to another site. But I don't know where that is in relation to this. All right, let's talk to this guy. Hey, buddy, what's up, man? Is someone there? A customer? Well, how long has it been? Well, dude, you're kind of in a dumb spot. Uh, he, sell, he sells gravity stone fan. Uses FP to emit fan-shaped gravitational shockwave. He sells gravity stone chunk. Uses FP to cause a gravitational explosion. Uh, we have a lost ashes of war. A celestial do. A nomadic warrior's cookbook. Okay, so he sells a couple of cookbooks here. Hmm. Okay, and I might be interested in this too. So, I mean, maybe. I don't know. So we've got 5,500. We've got 8,500 maybe that we want to spend. Here we've got prisoner iron mask. Iron mask forced on a prisoner. Convicted of an appalling crime. Thick, heavy, and utterly stifling. A foul creation designed to torment the wearer, either slowly fermenting hatred within their heart, or a spiritual fervor that is near indistinguishable from it. Why would somebody buy this? Tattered clothing worn by a prisoner convicted of an appalling crime, never once washed, every fiber is filthy. And this, are the, these are the tattered trousers. The smell is beyond belief. All right, let's let's buy some stuff from this guy. Let's see how much this is worth. Twenty five hundred. So I want to spend about or pop about five thousand more. Uh. I think these are worth 800 apiece. So that means I would want to use what, like, um, seven of them, maybe? Oh, I miscalculated that. Oh, well, that's fine. Something else? Purchase. Uh, I would like to purchase your Lost Ashes of War and your Nomadic Warriors Cookbook 16 and your Performers. Perfumer's Cookbook 4. So, the cookbooks... are here. Let's take a look. Yeah, I thought this is where the cookbooks were. I guess I'm wrong. Am I wrong? I don't know, man. Apparently they're considered key items. Nomadic Warriors Cookbook 16, a record of crafting techniques left by roaming nomad warriors, contains knowledge for surviving in the face of utter scarcity. Acquire the knowledge to craft the following. Thaw frost boluses, stimulating boluses. Perfumer's Cookbook, a record of crafting techniques left by a depraved perfumer. Contains perilous techniques no ordinary physician would attempt. Acquire the knowledge to craft the following acid spray mist. And this guy also sells this. Celestial Dew, a hidden tier found in the Eternal City, also known as Night Tier, allows one to carry out an absolution at the Church of Vows, reversing all antagonizations. Once upon a time, the stars of the night sky guided fate, and this is a recollection of those times. I mean, I don't really know if I need that thing. Here's the map of Ainsel River and Environs. Two great rivers flow beneath the lands between the Shafra, pronouncing that wrong probably, and the Ainsel. This vast region is said to be the grave of civilizations that flourished before the Erd Tree. So, I mean, do I want to buy this celestial do thing since I'm here? I don't know. Wow, it's 7,500. Eh, we'll just leave it here. 
I, I don't think I'm going to need that. Uh, I think that's for, like, in case you kill NPCs, you can uh, bring them back to life, maybe. Could be wrong about that. I think that's what that does, and I don't plan on killing any NPCs. I don't plan on it. <laughs> okay, so, um, there's got to be more to this place, right? Oh, crap. Is this... He can hit me from there? Oh, she, she could hit me there. Okay, well, that's not good. Um... I mean, I think I want to drop off of here, maybe? There's an item here that I want to get. Golden Rune level 3. Hey, what's up? Holy cow, something hurt me bad. Okay, we got some dudes down here. Oh, there's an item over there. You know I want it. Oh, I timed that poorly. Oh, these guys, uh... They hit pretty hard. Oh. He's getting ready to throw something at me, maybe. What are these things? Are these things I could pick up? They are. Silver fly fireflies. Grab some of those. Whoa. What was that? Whoa. Is there lightning or something? Hello, acquire materials. Ghost glove, ghost glove wart 2. That'll be useful. Ah, missed him. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. Oh wow, there's a bunch of these dudes. Look, there's two more of them over there. Golden Rune 3. Um... Hmm. Oh, well, that gone. I can't look at my map here. I was really hoping I could continue that way, but it doesn't look like I can. We need to figure out how to get up there and eliminate that thing at some point. Oh, hey, buddy. What's up? Oh. That was kind of creepy. This guy jumping down behind me. Whoa, 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 what's that? Okay, that was new. Whoa, holy cow, are you guys spawning? What's going on here? Oh, what's this? What's going on? Huh. Okay, then. Um... I don't want to be here anymore. Oh gosh, this whole place is lousy with trouble. Okay, those guys... Oh God, I still can't look at my map. I'm trying to go that way. There's even an item over there. Don't know how to get to. Right? I want to go... Go that way? Doesn't look like I can, does it? No, I can't, so. I'm trying to, um. Huh. I'm trying to see if there's a path up there. It's hard to do when you get this jerk shooting at you. See this? I don't know, man. I think we're gonna have to go a different way. Can't look at my map. That's so annoying. I kind of hate that. Oh, okay. So this is this place again. No, don't do that. Stop that. I don't like it when you do that. Oh, my. Oh, my goodness gracious. Oh, oh, my. Can I get out of here? Okay, there's a doorway over here. Let's go to it. Oh, oh. Huh. Don't fall down in there, dude. Um. Hmm. 
Boy, this is a... This isn't the one that takes me all the way back up to the top, is it? I don't know. Let's see where it goes. Let's see where it takes us. We haven't been here before. This is new. Hmm. Interesting. This one is called Ainsell River Sluice Gates. Okay. Hmm. All right. Great runes. Yeah, that's the only one we could apply. I haven't used any of those yet. Still don't really know the best strategy for that. Getting a look over the edge there. Surprised that I don't see any enemies here. Give me a little nervous. Okay, we're looking down, yeah, at uh, the area we were just in. Holy cow, look at all the dudes walking that way. <laughs> right over top of my head. Look at all those guys. A bunch of them. Yeah, you don't wanna you don't wanna spend any time down there if you don't have to. Can't tell if that goes anywhere or not. Yeah, there might be a tunnel there that goes someplace. And you don't want to drop down there. There's another herd right there. Don't know if that's the same herd that we just saw or not. What's up? There's your sluice gate. Look at this guy. Looks like he fell from above, maybe. Shatter shard arrow fletched. I'm worried something's gonna drop down on me. Let's make these stone level 3. Okay, I need level 5 to level up further my sword. But I don't think I'm going to find any 5s find any down here. This looks horrible. Okay, we're making our way up this way now. But this is a place that uh, we've actually already been. So, uh, when we originally came here, we came down here. And from here, I went this way. I went on this path. And then when we got to this junction, I must have gone this way. And always meant to come back this way, but never did. So we've already been that way where the ants are. So really we're just making our way back to the starting. Oh geez. Um, ouch, starting site. Uh, I'm just gonna try to get past these guys. I really don't wanna fight them again. Let's see here. Crap. Can't use my um, map so I don't know where I am exactly. Crap, 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 crap. Okay, this is not working the way I hoped it would at all. Holy cow, they're fast. Oh, this is a dead end. Okay. This is very bad, actually, uh, in case you didn't know. Oh, oh, look at you. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, my. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my. Oh, I'm dead here. This is where I die. Okay. Holy cow. Well, and that's exactly why you, um... <laughs> try to take them out one by one. Remember in the last episode, I was very, very cautious about pulling them out one at a time. And that was a good strategy. All right, I don't want to start from here again. I was trying to get here. Let's go and get here. 
<clears throat> excuse me, do I want to go back and try to get those runes? I mean, it'll be some work. And that whole time I had my... I didn't even have my shield out. So if... Oh, man. Hmm. I, I mean, it might be easier if I started start here. I don't know. Because this way I'm going to have to get past all of those dudes, and they are fast, right? So, I don't know. If I want those runes back, it probably does make more sense to go this way. So, let's do it. We'll fight these guys. Can I just drop off of here without hurting myself? I can. Alright, let's do this, man. Let's do this. Okay, I'm gonna go up here. There's the ants. Okay, we got one of them to drop down. Yeah, but another one's seen me and he's already coming this way. He's dead. This guy's gonna spooge on me. See, they're really not hard to kill one-on-one, -on -one, I don't think. This sword I've got, you know, apparently it's doing more damage since I've upgraded it so much. Oh, you, where'd you come from? Where did you come from? I'm not sure, actually. It's pulling me back. Yeah, this, this sword's doing a lot of damage. Okay. Oh, he come up out of the ground, it looked like. Another one. The, I mean, they're, these are really neat looking enemies, these ants. They are brilliantly done, I feel like. Very, very cool. Let's see if I could make it up here before they do. Just trying to get back to the um, site for safety here. Okay, I made it. Ooh, I'm surprised. Okay. Well, here we are back at this site. And uh, if you look at the map, you'll see that we could go this way. And we haven't gone that way yet. This place is freaking huge. So this time we're going to go to the right and see what there is to see. We know that there's at least one more side of Lost Grace down here because we saw it from that boss arena. I'm trying to keep my eyes on the sky. Yeah, here we got a dude right here. Don't know if I could shoot straight up. I can't. So we're just going to have to deal with it when he falls down behind us. Come on, is it that your MO, dude? Fall down behind me? Try harder next time. Oh, does this not go anywhere? Oh, crap. Um. Magic grease. Magic grease. Now that got put into my storage thingy. Let's see if this uh, puts out my uh, torch. Is not. Well, I can't go through it anyway. Well, crap, man. Now what? <laughs> I mean, we know there's so much more to this place. How do I get to it? I gotta figure this out here, maybe? Either this or something up here that I was not able to see. It didn't really look like this went anywhere. <clears throat> Excuse me. Other than off of an edge. Huh. Well. 
Now what do I do? Hmm. Don't think that there's another path here. Huh. Well. Sluice gate. Downstream. I mean, I've been here. And I thought I walked over here. But maybe I didn't? I don't know. It's, um... Hmm. Hmm. Okay. I want to... I think I want to try to go that way. But I think I've already done this and I couldn't get anywhere. Okay, let's, um, let's get up here where this merchant is and we'll take a closer look around. Maybe there was a ladder I missed. I do tend to miss ladders. And we'll see if there's a way to go from here. I don't see a ladder or any stairs that's going to take me anywhere. No elevator. Just this guy. I, I bought a lot of stuff from you, dude. Don't you have anything you'd like to say to me? Any hint or anything? Well, there you are again. There I am again. Divorce from one's trade does not come easily. Divorce from one's trade does not come easily. What does that mean? So if I stick my hand... Oh. Well, I mean... It's kind of a broken wall over there, but I don't think that's going to take me anywhere. Over there we've got... Um... Like a fallen column. I don't know how to get over there. Oh, these guys in this business. I really don't know, man. You're gonna have to Leroy Jenkins it here. Ouch. Hmm. I need to get over there. How do I get over there? And I've been down there where that guy is, but that didn't take me anywhere. Acquire materials? Ugh. Golden centipede? Man, centipedes... Centipedes really skeeve me out. Um... There's an item over there I haven't picked up yet. Well, by golly, let's go get it. I <laughs> hit him too. Ha ha ha. Shield Grease, that's a new one. Huh. Okay, nobody seems to be following me. Uh, it doesn't look like there's any path for me to get up there. Doggone it, this guy's gonna shoot something at me here. Look at that thing. Maybe it doesn't activate until I get close to it. Look at this guy right here. Here, I was thinking I had found a nice place to, like, do a little bit of investigation. But they have found me. Yeah, this jerk here. You, you're really annoying me, dude. Ooh, he dropped an item. Oh, silver firefly. Huh. Um, boy, I, uh... I don't know what to do here. Hmm. But I mean, look in that direction. Uh, I can't look at the map, damn it. Uh, that's the way I want to go right there, right?
What are you guys doing? Having a little powwow over there. I can't get over there from here. I mean, there's a, there's a lot of stuff up above. Including that crazy ass thing. And then... I mean, I can't make that jump over there. I've already gone to that waterfall and tried to get past it and there was no way to go. Um... So, yeah, man. I don't really know... what to do here. Boy, he's got a good aim. I'll give him that. Yeah, I've already been over here. This doesn't take me anywhere. Just take me back down there where I was before. These two guys, I guess, are sleeping or something. I'm not sure what they're doing. Oh, you jerks. Hmm. Well, um... I mean... Is this where I'm supposed to go? Gonna be easy with this guy shooting stuff at me. Oh crap. Oh. Oh. I got all excited thinking I'd found a place. Did I lose my lantern? Apparently I did. Um. Huh. There's like a slope there, but I don't think it's going to take me anywhere. This thing right here. Right? It doesn't look like it goes anywhere. What a tease. Huh. And I mean, if I tried to go up there, I don't think it's going to take me anywhere. Yeah, this isn't going to take me anywhere. I can't get anywhere from up here. So that does nothing. I've already been down there. Hmm. A pile of rocks here. And uh, I've already been in here where the, uh, the merchant is, so... I don't know, man. Hmm. Don't know. We've already been here, unless there was, like, a ladder that appeared or something after the battle, but I really don't think that anything like that happened. So from here... I mean, I kind of want to go over here. But uh, that's actually up above. And, um... Don't think there's a ladder anywhere. Well... This guy never did come alive. Even though I was sure he would. But he never did. Huh. Oh, darn it, I didn't want to do that. Oh, well. well. Maybe there might be a ladder in here, but there's not. Huh. Well, I uh, don't know where to go. Well, okay. well, I guess I kind of know where to go. I just don't know how to get there. I already dropped off of here once. So now I'm looking this way. So it looks like maybe there's a um, site down here. Maybe. But I 
I don't know how to get down there. Alright, well, I'm just going to hang out here by this waterfall and uh, end this episode, and then when we come back next time, I guess we'll try some other things. Not really sure what it is I'll do. But, uh, yeah. We will, um... I guess I'll take a closer look at the map and see if there's anything that I've missed. And, um... Go from there. Alright, that'll do it. Thanks for joining me. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why don't you let me know? Leave me a like or a comment. Thanks for watching. See you next time.